hello everyone in this video we will start to monitor a windows server using ncpa that is the nagios cross platform agent for that i have created a windows server here for this both i will allow port 5693 for the communication i will go to security click on security groups edit inbound rules and i will add rule that is to allow 5693 port this is for all cidr blocks and i will mention a description ncpa i will also add a rule for the icmp packets and for all CIDR blocks and I will save rules. The same I will do for the Nagio score server. Go to security, go to security groups, go to edit inbound rules, add rule 5693 and we can give a description ncpa and i will also allow the icmp v4 packets and save rules the next task will be downloading the ncpa agent from this url I will go to my Windows server. I have pasted the URL and the link opened. So I will click on this Windows exe installer okay now i can open the file click on next i agree with the license terms here the token i will specify as my token next 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 install So this has been installed here. If I go to local host, one moment once the agent is installed i am verifying if the agent is installed correctly or not
let me check the service So we are checking the service and we can see that NCPA listener and NCPA passive services are running. If I go to this URL localhost colon 5693, I need to go to advanced and continue to localhost. Here I need to put my token that is my token and I will click on login. I will go to GUI then to API. Here I will able to see the API data and if I click on live data you will be able to see this live data. Like if I select on disk and physical, physical drive zero. So this way you will be able to find all the data, right bytes, right time write count, read bytes, read count. And now we will proceed with the installation of check underscore ncpa.py in our Nagios server. For that, I am back in my rail instance. I will go ahead and download this star file. Now I will extract it. If I extract it, I will able to see there are changes dot RST and check underscore NCPA dot pi. I need to move this file to the lib exact folder in Nagios. First of all, I will change the owner and the write permissions. So it is done. If I do LSLA, I will be able to see. Next, I will move check underscore ncpa.py to user local nagios etc lib exec. Once it's done, what I will do, I will copy this. Check in cpa.py v. I'm able to get the version. Now I will do some command run to check whether it's working properly or not. I do have some strings here so let me check whether it's working or not
I will provide the host address so for host address I need to give one moment let me provide the private IP so let me go to console to Windows Server so this is the host and then the arguments t for token and let's see if it works or not so okay it's working i am able to retrieve the agent version now let's check for another cpu percentage So it is also showing percent and the states it's fine let me try with another So it gives me an whole information process count was 77 process count and memory is 82.67 memory VMS 1.05 ZB memory underscore RSS and processes matched so it gives me uh, all the details in our next video we will learn how to add this to our monitoring system. Thank you for watching.